This story is called Please Don't Make Me Fly. It's written by Elliot Kreloff. Way up high, in a very tall tree, nestled in the branches, if you look very carefully, you can see a bird's nest. In the nest, Mama Bird sits on her four eggs, keeping them safe and warm. The baby birds are ready to come out of their shells. Crack, crackle, crack. One, two, three, four baby birds. Mama names her babies Sally, Emma, Jackson, and the smallest one, Mo. The four little baby birds are hungry. See their mouths open? Mama flies away to get food for them. Every day, Mama brings food to her babies. As the days pass, the babies get bigger and stronger and start to grow feathers, although Mo is still the smallest. One day, Sally says, Mama, I'm ready to fly like you. May I try? Of course, says Mama. That's what birds are supposed to do. Sally spreads her new wings and jumps. At first, Sally starts to fall towards the ground, but then she flaps her wings and soars up, up, and away. Jackson and Emma cry out, us too, we want to fly too. They spread their little wings and dive off the edge of the nest. They both start to fall straight down, but then they flap their wings very hard and take off across the tops of the trees. Mama looks at Mo and says, well, Mo, are you ready for your turn? Mo is not. Oh no, Mama. I'm happy here in our nest. That's all right, says Mama. No rush. Later that day, Sally, Jackson, and Emma come back to the nest. I flew over a golden field with a big blue lake, says Sally. I can see them from here, sighs Mo. Jackson says, and I met some robins, and we flew together over the whole forest. I don't like robins, says Mo. They're noisy. What's the matter, Mo? Are you scared to fly? They all ask. I'm not scared. I could fly if I wanted to, says Mo. I just don't feel like it right now. You're afraid, says Jackson. Mo's afraid to fly. Mo's afraid to fly. No teasing, Jackson, says Mama. Mo will fly when he's ready. Then Sally says, I was afraid too, but I decided to try and it was okay. More than okay, it was super fun, says Emma. But we were all scared at first, even Jackson. No, no, yelled Mo. I'm not afraid to fly. Leave me alone. Mama says to Mo, Mo, it's okay to admit that you're scared. It's always the first step of being brave. Well, maybe I am a little afraid to fly, says Mo. How about if I fly next to you, and if you start to fall, I can catch you, says Mama. Would you be willing to try? Mm, I don't know. Mo is not sure, but secretly, he really wants to fly. Finally, he says, okay, I'll give it a try, but you have to stay very close. Mama and Mo stand on the edge of the nest. Mo looks down and sees the ground very far below. I'll go first, says Mama. Then you follow. Mama spreads her wings and jumps. Mo closes his eyes and jumps too. Help me, Mama, cries Mo. I'm falling. Catch me. You're doing fine, little Mo. Don't flap so hard. Let the wind come under your wings and carry you along. No, I can't. Please catch me. Then it happens. Mo feels the wind catch under his wings, and instead of falling, he is soaring. Look, Mama, I'm flying. And Mo flies with Sally, Emma, and Jackson over the tops of trees to the golden field. And sometimes he flies back home to visit Mama in the cozy nest. The end.